you know, I've been making a lot of tutorials, but I really haven't been making that many beats in a minute. So, uh, yeah, let's go ahead and make a simple beat inside of uh, Logic Pro 10.5.1. Let's do it. Bolo! All right, before we get started, make sure you guys like, subscribe, comment, and please turn on those post notifications so you will know the next time I have another video available. And if you like this video, hit that thumbs up or hit that thumbs down. I really don't care. So yeah, I've been making tons of uh, Logic Pro tutorials on how to use it and doing a lot of stuff with the sampler, but I haven't really made a beat. Today, I'm just gonna make a beat. I just feel like making a beat today for you guys, and hopefully you guys will like it. So I'm gonna make something pretty simple but I think it should be pretty cool. I hope it turns out pretty cool because I'm just gonna do it on the spot. I wanna kinda do some kind of up-tempo and something that got some space just for the artist to rap on. So let me go ahead and do that and uh, let's see how it turns out. <laughs> so let's go. All right, so I'm in Logic Pro right now and I'm going to go ahead and make a quick beat. I'm gonna try to come up with like a quick melody or whatever. Um, I'm using this uh, CMIV, which is in the Arteria collection right here, um, which if you don't have this, this is really dope because it has all the vintage stuff in there. Between that and uh, the Korg stuff, crazy. So it's the CMIV, which is like a replication of an old school sampler from back in the day. And uh, I got some bells. Kind of dope. So I'm gonna go ahead and come up with the pattern real quick. And from there, uh, I'm gonna put like a quick beat behind it. So let's get that going. I already got a bell already. Let me try to find. All right, that sounds decent. Let's go ahead and put that in there. So got that in there, one take, one take. So uh, I need to come up with like a little counter melody with that. So let me just uh, put that in there. Let me find some other sounds in this uh, CMIV. I think I found some, but let me just add it in. Hey, it doesn't sound too bad. Um, so now let's go ahead and add some drums to it. As you know, I made several videos on Logic Pro about how to do these drums. Now, since we have the new samplers, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to go into my Bolo the Producer drum kit folder, which has all the drums you need to make a dope trap style type beat. And I have a no limitations kit coming very soon. I'm finishing up on that right now. So look out for that new Bolo the Producer no limitations kit. And it should be out within the next few days. So uh, let's go into my files. And let's go to the Bolo Producer 2020 kit. And uh, let's get some claps in here. Yeah. So all we do is just slide this right on into here. We're going to do optimize. And there we go. And let's add that in here. Sounds good. Let's go ahead and add a hi-hat. Should be good. 
Let's do this optimize. And let me go ahead and create a MIDI region. And let's go into that. Close this out. And let me do this at a one eighth note and put this on the brush tool for right now. So this the root key. And let's go ahead and just draw these bad boys out. So let's go ahead and do this at a triplet. And let's put some of these right here. something right here. And we're probably going to do like a 30 second triplet. Alright, that's cool. Just gonna do something random for right now. I'm not gonna go too deep into it. So let's go ahead and do that. And let's repeat that. And then we're gonna do a open hat. Yeah, we we'll add that in there. Let's do that optimized. Let me just add that in there. Cool, so we got that in there now. So let's go ahead and add a bass in here. Yeah, let's go ahead and slide that in. Let's do optimize. sound good yeah, let's, let's go and add that in all right so that sounds good let's go ahead and first of all let me uh <laughs> get these notes let's see here yeah, yeah. Yeah, let's get these waddies all on the same level. There we go. And let's get out of that. Well, why'd I do that? So now let me take all of these and shift these down. All right. Shift it down again. All right, good, cool. Got those shifted down. Let's go back into the sampler. And 
let's go ahead and turn this uh, release and stuff up just a little bit more. We're going to turn this to mono. We're going to turn this release up. <laughs> another like little um like a little snare like kind of ride in between there yeah i always use that one so i was good Sounding good. Um, yeah, just making a quick beat. And let's go ahead and add just like a little percussion here. Just add that in there. For this one, I'm just going to create MIDI region. And then we're going to do this at 116th. The 16th note. Not that much. Let's go ahead and open this up. And let's go ahead and... Alright. I believe it should be right here. And now that we got that, exit out of that. And... That's cool. So we're just going to take that and we're going to copy that over here. And I'm going to do something that's kind of old school. I'm actually going to put a crash in the beat. People don't put crashes in the beat anymore. Just find me a symbol. Let's put a crash in there. Yeah, let's get that old school symbol. Yeah, old school crash. All right. This, oops, my bad. Did not mean to do that. Let's go ahead and take that and let's put it right here. Re replace that sound with this one. And yeah, let's see how that would sound. Like that. All right, there it is. Just made a quick and simple beat and it has some space open for the artists to put their vocals on it and it won't be a lot of stuff clashing and stuff. I don't I don't like to make a lot of beats with a lot of sounds in it. I like to make a beat just enough for the artist to do their thing on it. So you guys, if you wanna get this beat, make sure you go to my Beat Stars page. I'm gonna put a link in the description so you guys can check it out. I got a few beats on there, but I'll be adding a few more as time goes on. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Hope you guys learned something from it. And like I always say, peace out. And check out the beat.